Hello dear students. Welcome to this English class. Today I shall discuss the notes of the poem The Banyan Tree. Students do you remember I have already explained this poem before. I hope you have viewed watched the video and also surely you must have completed the assignment. Well today let's discuss the question answers of this poem. Do you remember who has written this poem? It is written by Rabindranath Tagore. Okay, let's discuss the meanings. First, I shall read the meanings. Then you can join me when I read it the second time. So, let's get started. The Banyan Tree written by Rabindranath Tagore Meanings Shaggy It means Untidy appearance Tangled It means Knotted Remember the roots of the banyan tree were tangled They are knotted Margin means border Now read along with me Meanings Shaggy Untidy appearance Tangled, knotted. Margin, border. Okay, now let's go to the next question. That is, give one word for the following phrases. Students, we have learned what phrases are. They are group of words. So, here there are a couple of phrases. You have to give one word for each of them. The first one, piece of cloth with design. And the answer is tapestry. Second one, tool used by viewers to view a cloth. Answer, shuttle. Now read along with me. Give one word for the following phrases. A piece of cloth with design is called as the tapestry. Second, the tool used by viewers to view a cloth is called as a shuttle. Question answers. Who is the writer of the poem, The Banyan Tree? The writer of the poem, The Banyan Tree is Rabindranath Tagore. Second question. Which tree is mentioned in this poem? The tree mentioned in this poem is the banyan tree. Read along with me. Who is the writer of the poem? The banyan tree. Answer. The writer of the poem. The banyan tree is Rabindranath Tagore. Next question. Which tree is mentioned in this poem? The tree mentioned in this poem is the banyan tree. Next question, why does the poet call the banyan tree as shaggy headed? The poet refers the banyan tree as shaggy headed because due to its untidy appearance. Next question, what is the child looking at? The child is looking at the tangled roots of the banyan tree. Read along with me. Why does the poet call the banyan tree as shaggy-headed? The poet refers to the banyan tree as shaggy-headed due to its untidy appearance. What is the child looking at? The child is looking at the tangled roots of the banyan tree. Why have the women come to the pond? Students, do you remember the image that is there on that particular page of the poem? You must have seen the women. What are they doing? You can open your textbook to that page and see what the women are doing. You can pause the video and check. Okay, the women have come to the pond to fill the jar with water. So, why have the women come to the pond? The women have come to the pond to fill their jars with water. 
what does the boy, boy little boy wish to be the boy wishes to be the wind the shadow the bird or the duck remember in the picture there's a little boy looking at the window from the window what is he wish what is what does he wish to be he wishes to be the wind the shadow the bird or the duck read along with me why does the why have the women come to the pond the women have come to the pond to fill their jar with water what does the boy wish to be the boy wishes to be the wind the shadow a bird or a duck next question choose the correct options the poet relive relives the memories of the options are his visit to the zoo his childhood his travel to a foreign country and the answer is childhood so repeat the poet relives the memories of his childhood now here there are a list of dictation words i will read you can read along with me T tiny bank pond child birds roots repeat t i n y tiny bank p o n d pond child birds and roots let's continue women window nested tangle branches remember repeat women window nested tangle branches remember so students i have discussed the notes the question answers of this particular poem the banyan tree please go through the video learn the meanings the question answers and complete the assignment that has been given thank you for watching the video and god bless you all